Howdy, folks. It's been a little while since I've been here, and just, I wanted a nice, you know, a nice relaxing leisurely time where I'm not trying to do anything and just, you know, content with a couple small bass. So I have come back to the golf course. Figure, nice little stop before work where I can, you know, more than likely catch a couple little fish, have a little fun. But man, grass has really grown up around here. So luckily, we got the uh, medium light, a little stouter. Can horse these fish to the grass a bit better. And uh, let's, I guess we'll just get to it and hope for the best. All right, like I said, I got, uh, got the medium light here and I'm throwing something a little different today. Never really used one, but I got a popper. I've just got it tied on already and apparently I didn't cut the excess off. I hear something popping in the weeds over there. So this is a top water bait. And you just kind of give it these hard little pulls and the water will shoot up around this little curved mouth and make a nice little splash. Sometimes a little ploop noise. I don't know if this is gonna do any good, but uh, it's definitely fish around. I'm gonna give it a shot. So it'll just there and float and you give it a little pull and it kicks some water around. Hopefully, getting some attention. Struggling a bit to uh, keep it kind of near the grass, but not tangling all over it. Well, this is clearly going to cause an issue. All right, this isn't going to work out the greatest. More of an open water lure. But maybe if I'm feeling up to it, maybe I'll go and uh, get a frog. I think someone's about to tell me to get off the course. Doing all right? Yeah, not bad. Hey, um, just to let you know, there's a major tournament about to kick off now. Oh, is there? Yeah, and obviously it's not safe for you to be out here when it happens. Yeah, guess I picked the wrong day, huh? Yeah, probably, yeah. All right, I appreciate it. So, um, are you a member anyhow? No. Well, you didn't tell me that. All right. But when you see the golf cart start coming around? You got a rough about how much time? Uh, now. Yep. All right. <laughs> Thanks, man. All right. I'm sorry, dude, but and I appreciate it. You know, it's just if you get hit by a golf ball. Yeah. You know, um, I'm not saying you would, but you can sue the club and they don't want that. Yeah. yeah. I got gotcha. you. Okay. Appreciate you. All right. Thanks. <clears throat> okay. Well, that didn't last long. He didn't necessarily kick me out, but uh, he was a nice enough fella. Just, you know, looking out for me a little bit and uh, make sure I don't sue the club. But I'm going to be nice, and I guess I'll leave. Come on, it's like, a, who's, who's holding a tournament on a Friday afternoon? I expect people to, you know, be at work. But I guess i got to find somewhere else to go, and uh, I'll find somewhere near work. Well... Here we are at Plan B, that creek by the highway that holds those big bass. Kind of, this grass has really sprouted up since I was here. Tromp right through it. It's the middle of the day, so it's gonna be a lot louder. But I got a new little lure to try. And it's this little plastic cricket smells an awful lot like plastic I think it's kind of cheap but I'm curious how it'll work
It kind of sinks. Well, sort of. I think if I just kind of throw it near some grass and move it a little bit. Might get some attention. I don't I don't rightly know. This thing doesn't throw super well. Even on the ultralight, but I mean it weighs like nothing. So I saw some fish follow and check them out. I think I just need to keep him making little motions on the surface. All right, this little thing's kind of a pain, doesn't really do much. Let's just go back to what we know works here. All right, we're just gonna go back to the old tried and true. I don't have any time to waste sitting around trying to figure out new lures. Let's just go to one that I know will catch fish. Or at least I have confidence in. Who knows what they want to do today. Yep. Oh, that was a good sized bluegill. I saw him briefly. That'll come back though. There's something. Oh, there we go, that's an okay little bass. You're what I was hoping to catch today. Little fish about your size. Stop it. Stop it. Open your mouth. Ugh. He really wants to keep his mouth closed. I've never had that with a bass before. Normally they're just, yeah, easy like that. There we go. He has a strong jaw, like I've never, had that much trouble like getting a bass of mouth open before but yeah that's about what i was hoping to get today oh that was another bass i saw it briefly as it let go See if he's still over there. Nope, that's a tree. That's probably my lure lost. Damn it. Yeah. There's something. Hey, another large mouth. Um, bring it over here. Come here, buddy. Ah, swing and a miss, huh? Nope. That's not too bad. hooks out of there. We don't want them down under the gills. There we go. Oh. There. 
Another nice little guy. Perfect size for the ultralight. Well, not the best time. My uh, original plan was flop as I got thrown out. And my secondary plan, I caught a couple fish at least, but nothing too grand. But oh well, that's fishing sometimes. I'll see y'all next time.